Buying or selling a home that is part of an estate sale really shouldn't be looked upon as much different. You still have a seller, which in this particular instance, as part of an estate, is an entity. You're typically dealing with an individual that's most likely a trustee for a trust. Their job is to get highest or top dollar for this property in this market. Whether you're selling a property that is part of an estate, it really isn't any different. There may be a couple more steps depending upon how many people are involved. There may be one trustee, but there might be multiple heirs to that particular trust. And the trustee is responsible for ensuring that all heirs are heard. Ultimately, the trustee will have final decision, but if the trustee really wants to make sure that they're keeping things cool within their family or within the heirs, they really do have to listen. So it may take a little bit longer, but really selling a home or buying a home in any market that is part of a trust or part of an estate sale shouldn't be any different whatsoever than any other sale.